What's up Star Wars fans, welcome back to the Hills Maniacs, I'm the Master of Movies Clay, and today I'm going to be talking about my top 10 favorite Star Wars actors. So I wanted to do this video because the past two weeks I talked about my favorite uh, Star Wars characters from the movies and then from the TV series. Uh, and so I wanted to talk about my top 10 favorite actors uh, in the Star Wars franchise, whether they're my favorite actors because they're in other stuff or just the way they portrayed the character. Um, and so let's let's get right into this then. Uh, and at number 10, I have Christopher Lee, uh, who plays Count Dooku in Star Wars. And uh, I put I put him at number 10 because the way he plays Count Dooku, I really felt uh, the the evil in Dooku when, when Christopher Lee played him. You know, I, I felt that kind of, like, wanting to do the right thing, but the right thing for him, not the right thing for everyone else. Uh, and he did just a great job in Attack of the Clones. Um, and he always does good when he plays uh, the villains. You know, he was Saruman in Lord of the Rings. And he's played Dracula before. You know, he's just a, a well-rounded actor who can do pretty much anything. Because I'm pretty sure he played Sherlock Holmes uh, at one point. So, he he can do a lot of different stuff. And so, that's why he's at number 10 on my list. Uh, number 9, I have Harrison Ford. Uh, I know a lot of you will be like, oh, he should be lower down on, on this list. Uh, but he's not for me. You know, I, I do like Harrison Ford, and he is in a lot of movies. Uh, and he's a, he's a good actor. You know, he's in a lot of movies, and, and I do like a lot of the stuff he's in. He does great as Indiana Jones. Uh, he does, he is, you know, Han Solo is a, a pretty famous uh, Star Wars character. And, you know, when, when you ask somebody to name somebody from Star Wars, most of them will probably say Han Solo. So, uh, I put him at number nine, um, just because of that. Uh, so number eight, I have Luke Skywalker himself, Mark Hamill. Uh, he gives a great performance as Luke in the original trilogy, you know, and then comes back again in the sequels, uh, seven, eight, and nine. Well, at the end of seven, into eight, and then Force goes to nine, um, but he's also in in other stuff. He's he's always been one of those characters that you you're supposed to try and relate to, uh, and he gives a great performance as Luke Skywalker, and so that's why I put him at number eight. Uh, number seven, I have Natalie Portman who played Padme Amidala, um, it, and I put her at number seven because uh, she is an Academy Award winner. Uh, she is a great actress. She does a great job. Uh, playing Padme in this movie and she's you know she's in a lot of movies she does great in in all of these movies and and I've always kind of been a fan of, of Natalie Portman number six I have Adam Driver who plays uh, Kylo Ren his performance as Kylo Ren uh, was was one of my favorite performances from an actor for a character um, you know, he just does, he gives a lot for this role, and you can tell that he's actually, you know, he, he actually cares about making Kylo Ren evil, uh, and, or at least in the first one, and, and the way he plays him, and, and when his voice comes through on the, you know, through the mask of, of Kylo Ren, and then you see his face, and he's got that, like, evil look, uh, he just does, and he's a great actor. I mean, we've seen him in other stuff, and he's he's great at doing other stuff. You know, he hasn't just played a villain in stuff. You know, he's been in TV shows, he's been in movies, he's done all kinds of stuff, and he's a great, great actor. So, um, I put him at number six. Uh, number five, I'm probably gonna butcher the name, but uh, it's Tamora Morrison or Tom Tamora Morrison, however you say that. Uh, the one who plays Jango Fett, uh, and he's he now plays Boba Fett in The Mandalorian. He's been in other movies. He was in Aquaman, uh, and I just I've he's always been one of those those actors who to me has some like iconic voice, uh, and when when I hear his voice come out on 
you know, as Jango Fett or Boba Fett, uh, I hear his voice. Like, if I'm not really paying attention to a movie, but I hear that voice, I know it's him. Uh, and, and he's good at delivering these different performances depending on the character uh, he, he plays. And so I put him at number five uh, on my list. Number four, I put David Prowse. Um, and that's because he played, he was Darth Vader in the suit. Uh, that's, and, and he, uh, you know, he did a great job at, at giving Vader that, that look, I think. And, you know, his, cause he was in the suit. Obviously he wasn't the voice. James Earl Jones did the voice. Um, but to be, you know, so, so tall and so, uh, strong looking, you know, that's that's what gave Vader that intimidating factor, and and he brought that to life uh, by playing Darth Vader, and so that's why I put him here because Darth Vader is is my favorite Star Wars character like ever, uh, so I put him at number four, number three I have Ewan McGregor, uh, Obi Wan was always my favorite good guy in in Star Wars, and I grew up with the prequels, um, you know one two and three. And, uh, Ewan McGregor was, was Obi-Wan and, and he, he just gave that performance, uh, and I was like, man, I want to be this guy, you know, and, and, uh, that's, Obi-Wan has always been one of those kind of like mysterious slash complicated characters to figure out. And then, you know, we've seen him in other movies, obviously he did great in Dr. Sleep. Uh, he was in Christopher Robin, he's in the live-action Beauty and the Beast, along with many other uh, movies, and so he's just a great, great actor, uh, and and that's why he's number three. Number two, I have uh, Samuel L. Jackson, and uh, the, reason, the reason I put him on here is because he does, he is probably one of the most famous actors. To have not only been in Star Wars, but to have been in the MCU, to have been in a lot of other movies, uh, and, you know, he's, he's a great actor, he can do so much uh, as, as an actor, and we've seen him in all kinds of different roles, and he always nails it every time, uh, and he's always been one of my favorite uh, actors, not just for Star Wars, just in general. And, of course, number one, rounding it off, we have my favorite actor, not just of Star Wars, but pretty much ever, uh, Liam Neeson. He's in everything, uh, pretty much. Um, and uh, he's he's great. You know, he has that iconic voice where when you hear it, you know that's Liam Neeson. Uh, and, he again, he does a lot of different characters i mean a lot of the the later movies you know the more recent ones it's kind of him playing a cop or some some type of law enforcement agent and something happens uh but still i mean it's different scenarios uh and he is up there in age now you know and for him to still be able to have roles like what he's still getting in movies and to still be a big star uh is is something that not many people can do and so for him to be able to do that and you know it's it, Liam Neeson is always one of those actors that like if he has a movie come out I'm gonna see it whether I, I really knew what it was about or not or if I think I'll like it or not uh, I'm gonna see it because Liam Neeson's in it and that's just you know he's as one of my favorite actors probably my favorite actor uh, it's it's just something that he gives that performance that, like, man, I want to see this. I don't care. The movie could suck, but Liam Neeson was in it. You know, so that's why I like Liam Neeson. So anyways, guys, there you go. That's my top ten favorite Star Wars actors. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Let me know who your favorite actors are in Star Wars and, and why, or even just who your favorite actor is in general. It doesn't even have to be somebody from Star Wars, but uh, make sure you like this video. Stay tuned for what else we got going on. We talk about Star Wars every Tuesday here on this channel, so uh, stay tuned for what we got coming up next week, and I'll see you guys in the next one. May the Force be with you. Subscribe.